Hey friends, welcome to my favorite session, permanent automations and evergreen marketing campaigns with WhatsApp. But first of all, what is a permanent automation? Well, these are nothing more than flows that exist and can be activated by any new contact at any given time inside of your ManyChat account. For example, think about creating a default reply that if someone texts you outside of your working hours, it is going to tell the user, hey my friend, we are no longer working for the day, we'll text you tomorrow. That is a permanent automation. And an evergreen marketing campaign can be, for example, whenever someone new contacts your business, wait for a couple of days and send them a message that says, hey, would you like to opt in for our super secret VIP discount list? This way, you're not just acquiring leads, but also reducing your costs for future strategies. So let's get started with our first permanent automation. The first thing you want to do is head over to your settings tab and go all the way to WhatsApp. You're going to see that the very first option is called the default reply. You're going to click on that one. So here you can see that I have already created a permanent automation that if someone texts me during working or non-working hours, they're going to get a different reply. Let's click edit and duplicate this so you can learn how to build it yourself. Awesome. Now that we are inside of our flow builder, let's go over each of our components. You will see that the first step says when user sends a message. When you click on that, you're going to see two options. If we want this flow to trigger every single time the contact sends a message that we do not recognize or once every 24 hours. I prefer to have them once every 24 hours, but that depends on you and your business needs. Let's click outside of here. And then let me show you conditions and how conditions can help your permanent automations. If you double click anywhere on the screen, you're going to find an option called conditions. Let's click here to add a condition. One of the coolest features inside of ManyChat's flow builder is the current time condition. For working hours, you want to click here where it says between. Keep in mind, ManyChat's automations work on military time. So let's imagine this particular business works from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. So that is from 0800 hours to 1800 hours. And they only open Monday through Fridays. So we're going to click any day and remove Saturday and Sunday. Once you click anywhere out of the screen, you're going to have a time-based condition. Mm, but as it turns out, this company also opens on Saturdays from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. How can we add that into our automation? All you have to do is click here to add a condition, select current time again, between, and write down the opening hours, remember, in military time, and select the day. But there is one little thing we have to fix. Unfortunately, quantum mechanics are not that advanced yet that we can be in two places at one, so we have to change this section right here. Does the contact match all of the following conditions? Well, our client can't be in both Monday through Friday and on Saturday. They can either be in one option or the other. So we're going to change this to any of the following conditions. Let's click anywhere outside of the screen. Let's connect this starting step to our new condition. And you can attach the green bubble to when you are working and the red bubble to when you're not working. And just like that, you have created a permanent automation that is going to be sent out to every user who triggers the default reply. Always remember to click update so your flow is published and updated. So the first thing we want to do is create the message. What are we going to send to our audience? And this says, hi there, first name. We have a secret VIP list of friends that get unique discounts and access to exclusive deals and events. Would you like to be a part of it? Let's add a button. And there we have the message that we're going to be sending. So the next step is figuring out when are we going to send this? So as I mentioned, this is an evergreen marketing campaign that will be sent out to every new contact that we get a little bit after they have texted us. So here there's two ways to go about this inside of the 24 hours or outside of the 24 hours after first contact. For that, all you have to do is click anywhere on the screen and add a smart delay. If you want to stay inside of the 24 hours and not use marketing templates, all you have to do is write X amount of hours here attach your steps to the message and this message is going to be sent out 23 hours after the first time a contact has texted you if you wanted to send this message let's say seven days after that interaction all you have to do is click over here 
the last seven days, and you would have to create a marketing message for this particular text. Attaching the smart delay to a WhatsApp message outside of the 24 hour window and selecting the messaging template that you created from this text inside of the search box. Huh, but wait 23 hours after what? What is the event that caused this 23 hours to begin? Well, you're absolutely right. We have to create a trigger. What you want to do is head over here, select new trigger, go to contact events and select new contact created and click save. Now let's go ahead and finish our flow. So what we just did here is send the message amazing. Thank you for being part of our VIP family. If you ever want to opt out, use the word garbanzo and we'll be sure to get you out of the list. And of course, you have to create a keyword automation for the word garbanzo. On our next lesson, I'm going to teach you all about keywords and how to connect your WhatsApp to your Facebook and Instagram ads. See you there.